How did you like working with Paul Wilson? I recommended him. I recommended him. Why would I not like working with Paul Wilson? I saw the potential in his talent that was on the tap, I think. I think he could be a, a force. And, uh, you know, I have an eye for talent. What can I tell you? I told that to the directors and writers, Mike Domino and Bob, the producer. And, you know, the rest is history. I just cattle prodded in the whole process. And he turned into a and, and he's still doing it. And I still do it. And I'm thankful for it. Okay. Yeah, so right. it was very good, you know. Uh, the movie Mott Haven is named after a neighborhood in the Bronx. You should actually ask him what's it like working with Robert Downey. Okay, yeah, let's do that. There go you ahead. go. Because that's the real question. Go ahead. <laughs> what's it like working with Robert Downey? Absolute bear of a guy, let me tell you. I mean, he didn't know his lines, no. Are you kidding? He's a lion on screen. An incredible ally and a wonderful, very giving actor, very thoughtful actor. He uses his phone a lot. Um, but no, he's, he's like my big brother, and thanks to him, I was able to work together. Yes, yes. But I'm saying, you know, I'm just threw that in so you get an extra thing there. Yeah. <laughs> a comedy routine. That's right. With the new Blues, Blues Brothers. With Gilbert Rowland. Yeah. The second comedy. Gilbert. Gilbert. I call him with the mustache Gilbert Rowland. People don't know who Gilbert Rowland is, but Paul with the mustache reminded me of Gilbert Rowland. <laughs> So I'm going to go ahead and ask that one again. Uh, it was in, uh, filmed in Mott Haven. It was about uh, this neighborhood in the Bronx. Yes. What, uh, what role did the Bronx play in the film? Well, the Bronx, the, the film is set uh, in Mott Haven, which is part of the Bronx. And it's a very important, it's a character in the film. It's a major character in the film. You, you played a Bond character, uh, I mean a Bond villain. You played uh, a lot of, you played a bad guy in the uh, Goonies movie. What's different about this role? Well, the role is, uh, it's a whole different story. You know, those are big uh, franchise films. And uh, uh, this year I'm playing a kind of a, a very interesting, mysterious character who you find out who uncovers. You know, usually when I'm playing a character, you know who he is from the beginning. Here you unpeel the onion as you go along, as we both go along in our relationship together. We uh, expose different aspects of us, of ourselves. I must say, Paul exposed much more of himself in this than I did physically. <laughs> That'll be in the European version. <laughs>